The Cymex Automated Subglottic Aspiration System is designed for aspiration of secretions from subglottic space to help prevent ventilator-associated events and VAP. This system, the only FDA-cleared automated subglottic aspiration system, delivers the most advanced technology available for the effective management of subglottic secretions. The Cymex is fully customizable to each patient for increased comfort during the aspiration process. Its quiet operation, safety alarms, and self-contained collection canisters are some of the amazing features designed to reduce risk of injury and infection. It's powerful, portable, and proven to make a difference for your patient. Your Cymex comes ready to use for your patients, intubated with an endotracheal tube or tracheostomy tube, both with a subglottic port. The Cymex system comes with a reusable rigid canister, one set of disposable canister liners with a solidifier, and sterile tubing for the clinician to open at bedside. The system has the ability to sit on a nightstand, a wall mount, or be mounted to a bed rail or IV pole. To use the Cymex, please ensure that the unit is either plugged in or operating from a charged battery. Based upon usage, the battery can last up to 72 hours. Press and hold the OK button for two seconds to turn the pump on. Once on, within five seconds, immediately press both the up and down arrow buttons simultaneously to access the setup mode. Use the arrow button to select parameters and press OK. You will notice the default time is set to 20 seconds. The Cymex has the capability to go from 10 to 60 seconds of aspiration time and 3 to 60 minutes pause time. Set your desired interval time and select OK. Patient aspiration timing may vary based on their secretions. Adjust accordingly. Next, adjust the desired pressure. The default pressure is 120 millibar, equivalent to 90 millimeters of mercury, with a pressure range of 60 to 300 millibar. Adjust pressure for your patient based on your facility-determined algorithm for your Cymex device. Press OK to start the pump. You will notice the tracheal secretion being removed. If adjustments need to be made to the parameters, repeat the previous steps. If adjusting pressure only, you can pause the pump and adjust. The Cymex has a variety of safety features. Once the pump has started, it will automatically lock in the parameter settings within 15 minutes. You will notice a key lock icon appear next to the battery icon. This is to prevent accidental parameter alterations during patient treatment. To unlock the unit, simultaneously press and hold the up and down arrow buttons. In the event of pressure buildup in the tubing, the system will release pressure to ensure patient safety. Please note that unlike wall suction, the Cymex device is a closed system which prevents backflow. The pump has an audible and visual alarm to notify the clinician of an error message. The screen will turn red with the readout describing the error. Errors can include a full or compromised canister, the system has air leakage, a low battery, or an occlusion alarm with auto release. To silence the alarm, press OK and make the necessary corrections. You will notice the pump is on standby mode if the screen is yellow. Once corrections have been made, press the OK button to resume the pump. Once a patient has completed usage of the Cymex, simply remove the canister and contaminated tubing. Proceed to sanitize the system by your facility protocols, similar to a ventilator, and place a new canister and sterile tubing. Now you are ready to use it on the next patient.